Hi there. Uh, this is a video showing how we plan to implement DVR recordings in the Zapperbox user interface. So you can record two ways. You can record from the grid guide or from the search menu. So this is the grid guide. And you see that um, the show called House Doctor has been selected. The red button is on. And um, you can go into this um, recording options menu pops up if you press the record button or the OK button um, in a future show. If you want to record the current show, you you only press the, the record button. The OK button will change the channel for current shows in this timeline. But anyway, the recording options uh, we are planning are record once, record all options, new episodes, remind me, which is just a notification that the show is about to start. And then um, start earlier by one minute, start later by three minutes. Uh, these will not be implemented probably in the first release. These will might come a little bit later, uh, but we plan continuous updates, obviously, uh, of the DVR. But um, on this, uh, wherever you're watching this video, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, um, Facebook, wherever, um, feel free to give us feedback, uh, ideas, what you think we could do differently or better or are doing wrong, whatever. Uh, we're posting this as we're developing the software so we get feedback. Um, there are only four slides here, so it's a short video. The next slide, um, uh, if, there's a, if there's a conflict in the recording, you get a warning and it says you're trying to record NCIS today, eight to nine, we need to indicate AM or PM. And these are the two conflicting recordings because this is a two dual tuner box and both tuners are busy at the time. So you can either replace uh, X files eight to nine or real life eight thirty to nine. And we show the time in each entry because the times might be different. And you might want to, based on the time, might want to skip you know, the shorter program or the longer program. In, in any case, if you hit cancel, of course, you'll not make the recording at all. Uh, third slide is, um, again, the press the record button and you get all the recording options and close is selected so you can get out of it by pressing close or I believe by pressing the right arrow, you can uh, get out of this menu. And the final menu, final screen rather we have is recording from the search menu. This will get more, more interesting once we have 14 day guide data. Um, which will, which is scheduled to come out, be released before DVR. Let's see how that goes. Uh, a lot of implementing DVR is really experimenting with a lot of different options available um, within Android and trying to um, get things to work correctly. A lot of the underlying software needed for DVR is already working. Um, so here um, you some you know you typed selected a keyword called football. This popped up. Uh, it's already selected and it says record once. You can change it and then hit close. So uh, that's the last slide. Please um, comment on uh, any of the social media platforms. If you're on YouTube, please subscribe so you are notified when we post the next video. And we're looking forward to releasing this um, as soon as we can. Everybody's working diligently to get this DVR software working. The first release will support only pause TV, and then we'll keep adding these other features. Thank you.